Hi, it's Alaska Granny. No matter where you live, I hope you're storing water for emergencies. You never know when your family's safety and security could depend upon fresh drinking water. Know that whatever container you use, you need to sanitize it before you put it away. So what you want to do with a 55 gallon barrel is fill it up with about one gallon of water, add five tablespoons or capfuls of bleach. Make sure you use unscented bleach. Then roll the barrel all around so that every surface on the inside gets washed with the bleach water. Then you want to pour that out. Once you've sanitized your barrels, you want to decide where they're going to be before you fill them up because each barrel will weigh over 450 pounds when it's full. Never set it directly onto a cement or concrete surface because the concrete can leach up chemicals and spills. So you want to put them on something like cardboard or a board of wood before you set your barrel in place. Once you get your barrels in place, make sure that they're level and that the bunghole is in a spot that it's easy for you to reach. And you're ready to fill it up and then you're going to have your water ready no matter what emergency comes along. Make sure though when you store your barrels that you have a barrel wrench or what's called a bung wrench so that you can open these in an emergency. You also need a siphon shaker hose so that you can access the water or some kind of a pump because you want to be able to get the water out. Once you fill these up, they weigh more than 450 pounds. Each gallon of water weighs just over 8 pounds, so these are too heavy to do anything with. So make sure that you have them where you need them, that you're able to access them, and you know you're going to be okay no matter what comes along. Learn more at alaskagranny.com. Please subscribe to the Alaska Granny channel.